Hello YouTube, this is Asatsu5. I thought I'd come outside and film a video for you real quick. This is my valet tray slash valet chest, whatever you want to call it. It's where I organize some of my EDC items. Um, and um, just this is just a little show and tell type thing. By the way, I bought me some calipers for both knife and uh, watch review. Uh, this has been fun to play with. But yeah, uh, this is where I keep some of my go-to EDC items. Just because I have uh, stuff in here doesn't mean I carry it every day. Uh, you know, because a lot of times, most of the days, I'm at work. And my EDC changes from work to uh, in-town or weekend uh, EDC. So uh, what I, what I uh, take to work on a daily basis is different than the stuff that's in here. But I thought I'd show you this. All this is is a tea chest. It came with an assortment of teas and um, and um, I somehow ended up with it. I'm not entirely sure how. Uh, my stepmom like um, my stepmom uh, did something for the neighbors and then um, uh, uh, her and my uh, uh, dad separated or divorced and um, I ended up with this. Like this was payment for her or to her. And I guess since she wasn't around, I got it. I can't remember the whole story, but it's something like that. But I kind of let the finish go to hell. Um, and uh, I was looking on Amazon for valet trays and stuff. And uh, then it kind of clicked, hey, I have this. Why not use this? And I took some stuff off of it. I found it uh, and uh, realized that I scratched the finish of it. But it's still a good wooden box. So let's see what's inside. And you probably can't see that well in there. I'll go over some of the stuff. Um, got my, um, I own three rings, but these are uh, two um, very special sentimental rings for me. And um, they both don't fit. I tried the really crappy, you know, tape thing. And uh, I don't like pinky rings. And these just fit on my pinky with the tape. Um, but, um, you know, grandfather's ring and sentimental rings and stuff so I have those in there I need to get them I need to get them sized um, well let's look at something interesting this is um, my FN uh, 1905 1906 depending on what side the pond you're on it's a 25 and um, I'm not going to safety check it right now because I know that it is loaded and uh, you know because I told you it was loaded if I was handing it to you, you know, I would safety check it, unload it, but that's not the case. I'm just keeping it where it's at. That's it. Uh, I also have my Hikonagami uh, knife in here. I have my one of my favorite EDC knives, the Endora, the Noltol, and the K55K. Also, some knives I have in here are my Alox. Uh, um, Pioneer knife and my William Henry which I'm gonna go ahead and show you um, uh, unfortunately the diamond fell out of the button I don't know how much that's gonna cost to uh, fix but um, yeah I got some of my favorite EDC knives and dress knives in here um, this is where I keep my Seiko when I'm not wearing my Seiko and uh, my Apple Watch has been acting up on me ever since the new update. So I haven't been wearing my Apple Watch. I've been wearing this one, this uh, um, Wangle Grenade Nero. And uh, so this is currently my EDC watch, what I wear at work. And I also have my Dressier watch in there. They happen to both fit. I guess I'll put this in here for now. Then um, I have my silver dollar, which I just needed a place to put put it in. Got my um, safe key, not my gun safe key, but my safe key. Um, some random parts from a project that I did a long time ago. Another safe key. I got chapstick um, that I made myself. Um, scented uh, hand sanitizer I really like I like this nori scent or nor scent and I like the ocean scent from uh, Bath and Body Works 
see what else do I have in here. Uh, pocket cross, which ends up in some of my videos as decoration. Um, some pins. That's from my, when I made my laser. Also from when I made my boarding laser. Huh. There's a LED for a mini mag light. LED conversion. Huh. I wonder if I can find a mag light that can fit that. Had no idea that was in there. But, um. Yeah, um. This is just my valet tray. See if I can get a shot of this. And you probably can't read it. But, um. It is, I think it's Tico or Tika uh, International. And I just thought I'd show you my valet tray. Uh, like I said, um, like um, I don't uh, carry this stuff on a daily basis. Uh, if I'm going into town, I'm grabbing stuff out of this um, um, uh, chest. Uh, probably like the. Uh, Endora, the, and the big decision is, uh, the reason why I have the 25 in there is just as a convenient place to put it, and, um, you know, sometimes I'm trying to decide, do I want to carry my 25 or my, or my Warthor uh, 9 millimeter? You know, depending on what I'm dressed in, what time of the year it is, what's easier to carry. If I'm just going to town for a little bit, sometimes I'll just pop this in my back pocket and call myself armed. And you, you see how uh, these are segmented out? It was like that all over here, and one of the first things I did was to get my uh, knife, um, I think it was a Cold Steel uh, Voyager, and I batoned um, the compartments out of this area, and this removes. So I basically removed this, batoned it uh, flush right here, and um, I have my uh, six compartments over here, and my big compartment right there. So um, I just wanted to share that with you. It's, something pretty interesting in my opinion uh, I, I don't know where you'd get a chest like this but this is my setup for my EDC uh, valet tray that's it I'm a Satsu 5 and I'm out